Welcome to Going Infinite, where we infinitely talk about Hogwarts Legacy stuff. So, Hogwarts Legacy is coming up, you know, like four months from now kind of thing. Um, so, I figured I am going to be... I made a new account into this, thewizardingworld.com or pottermore.com, etc. And I'm just going to see what kind of house I'd be situated in. Before in the past, I took this test before, I think in 2019 or 2018. I'm not entirely certain with my years about it, but I was placed in Slytherin. Uh, a lot of my friends were actually pretty shocked about it, but I, I, I was placed in Slytherin. I feel like I was probably close to Gryffindor, but I, 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 I can't really say for sure. But yeah, I figured as time goes on, you change as a person and you know, you, 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 you can get placed somewhere else because it's, overall it's a personality test. And so if I stick with Slytherin, I stick with Slytherin, I'm probably going to play a Slytherin when I first played the Hogwarts Legacy game, but I was just kind of curious what I would do and I would make a video about it. So yeah, let's first start with the house, then we'll move on to the Patronus and the wand. If you guys are looking for the link, I'll put it in the description if you guys don't want to type out wizardingworld.com or pottermore.com. But yeah, let's get started. All right, first things first. Uh... Yeah, apparently it wants me to download the app. No. Oh, it says or. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's figure out what I said. Yeah, you can do this on your phone. Um, I decided to do it on my computer because it's easier to record on my computer. Um, asking me dawn or dusk. Use one. I'm going to have to choose nighttime. I am a night person, that's for sure. Yeah, hundred percent. Four boxes are placed before you. Which would you try and open? Gleaming jet. Oh, okay. This giving me options. Okay, and then it says select. Okay, I see where we're at. The gleaming jet black box with a silver lock and key. Okay, it's the same thing as this picture with a mysterious rune that you know to be the mark of Merlin. Oh, we are really getting hinted into Hogwarts Legacy at this point. Um, the small pewter box. Unassuming and plain, with a scratched message upon it, it reads, I open only for the worthy. Ooh. Sounds like Thor's hammer. The small tortoise shell box, embellished with gold, inside which some small creatures seem to be squeaking. Interesting. The ornate golden casket standing on a clawed feet whose inscriptions warns that both seeker, secret knowledge and unbearable temptation lie within. This, this is actually pretty tough. I actually don't know what I want to choose. I want to do the worthy one. You know, if I choose the box to be worthy and I'm just not worthy, that would, uh, that would be really unfortunate. Then I have a box I can't open until I find someone who's worthy. Just so I could satisfy that thinking. Uh, but that does sound more fun. Actually, this one seems a lot more fun. Uh, what temptation lies within? Unbearable temptation. That sounds like a lot of different things. I'm going to have to go for the worthy, you know, because... Uh, I really want to choose worthy, but the temptation one seems... We're going for the worthy one. That one just seems more fun which one would I choose glory love power wisdom <clears throat> um wisdom for sure that's what makes them think so there's something I'm missing about this a muggle confronts you and says that they are sure you you are a wizard or witch. Witch or wizard. Do you ask what makes them think so? Tell them that you are worried about their mental health and offer to call a doctor. Agree and ask whether they'd like a free sample of a jinx. Agree and walk away, leaving them to wonder whether you are bluffing. That one sounds pretty funny. Uh, I'd, I'd have to go with the first one. I'm f my initial thought is definitely going to be the first one. Which would you rather be? Liked? Trusted? Feared? Envied? 
imitated, praised. Um, I would have to say trusted. Trusted number one. Ooh, which one am I gonna pick? That's what I'm assuming this is. If you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? Um. I love cats. I just can't. I, I love cats. Yeah, cats is gonna be where it is. What kind of cat? Okay. Ginger cat. If you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? Ginger cat, white cat, Siamese cat, tabby cat, black cat. That is actually tough. I've had a black, I've had a white cat, I've had a black and white cat, but I don't think I've ever had a red cat. Ah. Uh, this is tough. I'm gonna have to choose the white one, actually. My, I have a cat that's like white with like black spots. I think I'm more familiar with white. What about murder people? Which of the following would you most like to study? Murder people? Interesting. Centaurs, werewolves, vampires, goblins, trolls, ghosts. Probably ghosts. And possibly vampires. <sighs> Choose one to continue, white or black. Dang, I like both. You know, when it comes to a room, I'd rather prefer the room to be dark. Oh, it's right. I don't really see this being a uh, personality quiz anymore at this point. I mean, not really a personality quiz, but you know what I mean. I felt like that was too short. Slytherin, yeah. Yeah, you probably... Know that some of Slytherin's most renowned members include Severus Snape, Bellatrix Lestrange. Did you know Merlin himself was Slytherin? Or that according to legend, the ribbon of a first class order of Merlin is green to reflect his Hogwarts house. The Sorting Hat has spoken. And you're not alone. 7,517 fellow Slytherins have been sorted into this ambitious Hogwarts house today. Fellow Slytherins, fellow Lestrange. Message from a prefect. That's cool. Or perhaps in Slytherin you'll make your real friends. These cunning folks use any means to achieve their ends. That sounds... That sounds scary. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so I'm, I'm definitely 100% Slytherin. 100% Slytherin all the way. Better with headphones, you say? I wonder what they mean by this. Oh, they added some audio. Whoa. The, fin the Patronus is kind of a positive force of projection of the very thing that the Dementor feeds upon. Hope, happiness, and desire to survive. Discover your Patronus. Questions are time to go with your instincts. All right, let's find out. This looks like fun. Relax, think of your happiest memory. Shoot, I've been thinking about this actually a lot. It's tough, it's really tough to say what it is. What are we doing here, am I choosing? I am choosing. Okay, okay, so we have to be quick about this. This is different from years ago. Serve, protect, or seek. Protect, for sure, 100%. Bright or shadow? I, I like the dark, I don't know what it is, but I just like... It's more calm to me. Think, sense, feel. Sense. What 
What is happening? Something is trying to emerge from your wand. Keep going. Yeah, I feel like we gotta redo the other one. Why? Who? I guess why? Alas, not fast enough. Concentrate on your happy memory and try again. Wait, what? I thought I clicked on it. Could have sworn I was ready for that. Together or alone? Together. This is pretty cool, actually. I, li I like this. I like this a lot. Listen, watch, touch. Watch. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's getting dark out here. We're probably gonna see Dementors. Click, drag, and release for your Patronus. Okay. My bl Patronus is a Bloodhound. In my last account, it's a Tabby Cat, so that's... Really... Really interesting, actually. This was different. It was pretty cool, though. I don't. I don't know what to say. They really. They really changed that. That whole experience. Okay. I guess we'll discover the wand. I don't remember what my last count was for the wand. Yeah, let's find my wand. If it's gonna be just as cool as what we did with the Patronus, this is gonna be exciting. Would you describe yourself? Tall, short, average height? I would say average height, 100%. Uh, are your eyes dark brown, black? No, they are neither of these. They are specifically hazel. And always changing colors. Was the day on which you were born an odd number or an even number? It was an odd number. You most pride yourself on... Imagination. Traveling alone down a deserted road, you reach a crossroads. Do you continue? Left towards the sea, right towards the castle, ahead towards the forest. Uh, I'm going towards the castle. Do you most fear? Uh... Shoot, this is actually tough. I don't know what to say. I love the dark. Um... Fire. I guess fire isn't entirely pleasing to me. Um, I mean, I am afraid of fights, but I always... I like to do parkour and stuff like that, so like... I'm not afraid, it's more excitement? Or convince the fear to be excitement? I don't know. Isolation, small spaces. Small spaces, sometimes I just don't like it. Isolation. No, I like to be by myself. Oh, this is tough. It's either between fire heights and small places. I'm gonna go with fire. No, I'll go with heights. I'll go with heights. Yeah, let's go with heights. In a chest of magical artifacts, which would you choose? Silver dagger, glittering jewel, golden key, dusty bottle, bound scroll, ornate or mirror. Uh, this is kind of tough. Uh, we'll go with golden key. I like keys. Is that it? Hawthorn wood with the unicorn core. 12 and a half and slightly springy and flexible. I think the uh, flexible part was just like how it was. Uh, the wood, I don't think so. And I had dragon heart string. And I don't think my wand was as long as 12 and 1 fourth quarter. Yeah, 12 and a quarter. Slightly springy and flexible. Wow, that's interesting. Yeah, that's different. That's different from my old account. Yeah, that's re that's really different. Hermione, no way. Characters in their wands. No way. And Albus, okay. That's pretty cool. Okay, so down to the point we got Slytherin, Bloodhound, and the Hawthorne wand. Okay. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna pull up my old account and just kind of compare. Okay, so yeah, this is my old account. I got Slytherin, Ragdoll Cat. 
and the maple wand. Let me click on that just to see the details of this. Yeah, maple wood with a dragon core 11 and a half. Okay, and quite bendy and flexible. Yeah, I do I do remember this stuff. Uh, not dragon heartstring, but yeah, dragon core for sure. Who who else had it? Characters and their wands. Discover more. Oh, that wasn't saying. I don't know what I was thinking. Wait a minute. Dragon heart string. Yeah, that was describing other people's wands. It wasn't telling me the resemblance of any kind of way. Whatever. Anyways, yeah, so the. This is what I got in like 2019. I'm pretty sure it's 2019. When I logged out of my other one, it showed me. Yeah, July 7th of 2019. That's when I figured all this out. But yeah, uh, that's the end of this video. For sure we're gonna have to be uh, Slytherin in the uh, Hogwarts Legacy game. That's the first thing we're doing when we get that game is House of Slytherin and probably choose what this probably to choose the same thing as I'll probably link the new account because you know that more reflected me but I don't know we'll see we'll see I kind of like this one way better because you know dragon core but yeah I'll see you guys in the next one video bye